Hey guys, it's Carolina. And I've been getting a lot of responses on the internet about who I look like, and it's been pretty unanimous. So I decided today, I don't have anything to do. I haven't done makeup in a while, so why don't I just transform myself into my Broadway twin that is Sophia and Caruso playing Lydia Dietz from the Beetlejuice musical. I love Beetlejuice the musical. So today we're just gonna kind of see what I have in my closet and we're just gonna see if I can look like her. So let's do that. I'm here my very messy closet. We'll talk about that later. But we're gonna try to see what I can find in here. I found this shirt that's so very Lydia-esque, but she wears a dress. So I'm gonna see if I have a black dress I could definitely pair this with. Funny story about this dress. My mother had purchased this dress for me um, because she was like, this is definitely you. But I'm getting Lydia Dietz vibes from this. So I'm curious if I put this under this to get the sleeve effect, how it would look. Let's give it a shot. Okay, so don't laugh, but this is the outcome of both of them combined and I'm not digging it. We're not digging it. So back to the drawing boards. So I just took the bottom part of the shirt off and I like just how this looks. Just kind of simple, plain and black. And this is the closest thing you can find in my closet. So we're gonna go with this one. So we're here, we're wearing the dress. We're gonna do some makeup. Now, I, this is a warning. I am not good at makeup. Like I, I do it, it's fun. I love it so much, I suck at it. Sorry, I look crusty. But I'm not good at it. So any judgments, please remember, I'm not part of the makeup community. Those people know what they're doing. I, on the other hand, I do not. So let's get started. So we're gonna open up my mirror first. Hey, whoa, who's that? This is like my, this is my little makeup thingy. I'm gonna pin my bangs back because a lot of people don't like that I do things on my face without pinning my bangs back. I should start by priming my face, huh? So I'm gonna be using first Ordinary primer. I feel like such a beauty guru. <laughs> Ordinary primer right here. Just gonna go. Skibadoosh, skibadoosh, boop, beep. Yeah, I'm shaking. All I've had is coffee and like some fun Betty cake. Some leftovers, put it on my eyelids. Oh, fair warning. My eyeshadow never wants to stay on my eyelids. We're hoping for the best here. We're ready to, we're ready to go. Ka ciao. I watched her video. She doesn't wear eyeliner, which like, if you know me, you know that like hurts my heart because I love eyeliner so much. So what she uses on her eyes is she takes like the lightest color on her palette. So I'm gonna be using probably my Naked Urban Decay Smoky Palette. I grab my makeup brushes here. This is the e.l.f. brushes. Sophie Ann Caruso takes the lightest color on her palette. So the lightest color on this palette is probably this one. I'll probably do a mixture of, this one is called 13, and this one is called Combust. So I'm gonna be doing a mixture of these two. So. And like I said, we're mixing the two, so I'm just gonna grab another bit of this one. Then she takes the purple. She tries to make her eyes look a little bit more sunken in. Um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and take, let's go purple. I'm feeling it. So this one's called Smolder. Oh, on the crease. I'm just gonna go ahead and take, just for funsies, this color is called Whiskey, it's this brown. I just have an attraction to that color, so I'm just gonna take that and we're just gonna pat it into the inner side of my eyelid so it creates like somewhat of a little smoky effect. Okay, I'm not gonna lie to you, 
this looks kind of cool. This size also actually bigger than this one. I call this my lazy eye. It's not necessarily lazy, just looks lazy. Like just get up, open your eyes, dude. Like what are you doing? Like I said, not a beauty guru. Never said I was. I'm gonna pull my lashes. With the tweezer man, we love it. It's a classic. Went to high school with a girl who showed up to school one day and was like, yeah, I was doing my eyelashes and cut them all off. And I audibly screamed in my second period Bible class. Don't like to do mascara typically until the very end. So we're just gonna hold off on the mascara until later. So I'm gonna take my e.l.f. color correcting stick. I'm just gonna put this a little bit over here. So I've mixed that out supposedly. I'm gonna take my CC cream. This is in the tone light. I haven't used this in so long. Literally have not used makeup in, in this pandemic. I'm gonna go Scooby Doo Bob, 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 Bob. Now Sophia and Crusoe, she doesn't wear foundation, she says, because she doesn't like how blocks the pores. She also doesn't wear concealer, so I'm just not, I'm like, if you know me, you know I can't go anywhere without concealer. I'd much rather go out with concealer than, than this coverage foundation stuff. My bangs coming out of this is gonna look wicked, you guys. Absolutely wicked. Like I said, I'm not gonna be doing concealer. Gives me like that little edgy teen look, right? Next, I'm gonna take my Perfect Finish HD Powder by e.l.f. Honestly, I didn't mean to get this powder when I bought it. I was trying to get the loose powder, but I was buying online and I didn't read right. I'm sorry. So I'm just gonna... <laughs> She literally does nothing else. I should do mascara now though. I use the L'Oreal Voluminous Original Mascara. This is a different color, because again, I bought this online and I didn't read. If you learn anything from this video, remember to read your mind online. I love lashes. Like I, I love doing mascara. I love fake eyelashes so much. I wish my eyelashes were more like, wow, but I add like so much mascara to my eyelashes because I have no chill. And there's kind of the finished look with the mascara. She does some under eye thing also, but before I get to that, I'm gonna do the lips first. So I just let the mascara dry so it doesn't interfere with the under eye thing. So we're gonna like experiment a little here today. So I originally thought that Sophia and Crusoe had a black lipstick for her portrayals, Lydia. But she doesn't, and they actually may have bought a black lipstick for this video, sorry. She has like a dark purplish. So I think if I experiment with a couple of two different colors, we can make something happen. So first, I'm just gonna line my lips. This is literally the only lip pencil I have, so don't judge me. It's Max Soar. I've literally had it since I was 18. I also don't know how to line my lips, so. So this is kind of like what the lip pencil looks like. I have never used black lipstick before and I'm terrified. I don't want to ruin like that color with this. So I'm going to take this little lip pencil, small, small precision brush. I'm just gonna... It works with my So now that the lips are kind of taken care of, so this is Color Sensation by Maybelline, and it's in pitch black. It's number 845, if you can see it right there. Okay, so now that we've kind of done some pretty good lips, if you ask me. She uses a little like red color to go underneath her eyes to make her look more tired. I don't think I have a red color. So the closest like red color I have is probably between Hive Drip or Sting. This is the Naked Naked Urban Decay Honey Palette. And so it's like any of these three right here. I think I'm just gonna mix Sting and Drip together to give it somewhat of a reddish under eye appearance. I think a big difference between Sophia and Cruz and I is I have like huge bulbous type eyes and she 
doesn't. So I have like white underneath. I kind of want to color that in. You like put the makeup on and all of a sudden you feel like, yeah. So I think I'm going to just fill in my waterline. I'm going to try, I've never used this before. This is Clinique Pretty Easy Liquid Eyeliner Pen. This is what my finished makeup look is gonna be. So I'm gonna use my Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. <laughs> Ta da! Fix my bangs real quick. I hope they stay in place. I just remembered that I gave my 90s choker to my cousin. So I'm just gonna use this one. It fell. It's fine. I'm honestly not hating it. And this is the eyes, under eyes, choker, little detailing. What is that? Oh, this is from the choker. Little detailings in the dress, you know. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe. Let me know what else you want to see. This is kind of my first video that I've done in like four years. So what do you think? Let me know in the comments also if you think I look like Sophia. <laughs> okay, thank you guys. Keep the party going. Bye.